Hello, AJ Hennessy here and welcome to this week's video. So this week's video is basically going to be about what I am currently loving and this is the skincare edition. Yeah, so if you are interested in knowing what I'm currently loving or basically about skincare in general, please stay to the end of this video and give it a thumbs up if you like this video and subscribe also, it's free. Thank you. So let's dive into this video. Okay, basically what I am going to be talking about is what I am currently loving like I stated before uh, When it comes to skincare is what I rave about like every single time of my life for Since I've been in high school till now after uni and now that I'm an adult officially <laughs> Basically everything I rave about is either skincare and recently is fashion so um, I have done some try and error and yeah and finally uh, I don't know I have gotten my hand around the whole thing that I'm currently loving at the moment so basically what I'm on about is I'm a beauty consultant yes and also I own a skincare brand so basically what people I need to start saying basically anyway when people come to me and ask me to plan their skincare routines i basically ask ask them about their um i don't know their skincare needs how their skin type is and if it's not a face-to-face -face communication probably or uh, over the internet i probably do the zoom call or photo um photo consulting basically right now is photo consulting so it's more easier and you just send me a video or facial probably what is your problem topically so yes that's what i'm on about and my beauty brand is basically about uh, all skin type really only about uh, light skin i'm very interested in the dark skin actually most of my clients are actually dark skin brown skin and less of light skin actually so yeah and people with acne prone skin and problematic skin anyway so yeah that's why i dive in and that's what i'm more interested in so what i'm currently loving based on my experience and uh, my skin problems uh, i'm going to be listing a few i might not go through everything in this video but i'm going to be listing a few of the things that i'm currently loving so yeah like three to five years ago or two to three years ago i discovered that i have psoriasis and this happened just like that so i was just over my head and i was trying to get so many things to stop the flare-ups the itching and everything that concerns the psoriasis because it was all new to me and I did not know how to actually go about it because I've not had any clients that had like psoriasis in the past or like anything concerning psoriasis or major major like um, skin problems like eczema um, and the rest of them actually <laughs> I don't know how to mention them now so yeah um, it was over my head how to like go about my problem and I started trying to do um, use tubes that had psoriasis um, emblem on them that it works for psoriasis and blah 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 but then it did not stop the itching then I I don't know googled so many things remember I am a beauty consultant but it does not mean that I know everything so I reached out to some people that were also beauty consultants like me but no avail you have to buy products from them and blah 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 and I'm not on about that so I just decided basically on my own to sit down and know what my skin type is and basically do what is necessary for my skin and i discovered i have dry skin this i discovered five years ago even yeah before i started my brand actually but five years ago i discovered that i have dry skin so i think that also is part of the issues that fled up my psoriasis because i was not moisturizing my skin enough with the right moisturizers and it made my I don't know my dry skin drier and I think that's where the psoriasis came from or well, maybe it's hereditary I'm not sure but anyway three years ago I had psoriasis and I was very confused on what to use or what to do so like two years ago I discovered what I needed to do and 
thanks to TikTok and other uh, institutions and other skincare people. So, and basically TikTok, TikTok actually, it's from TikTok that I discovered um, CeraVe. And CeraVe was, <laughs> CeraVe was like 100% the rave like two years ago, like during, in fact, during lockdown, CeraVe, CeraVe has been for years, but CeraVe became very popular like two years ago on TikTok. I think it blew up on TikTok, I'm not sure, but CeraVe, I don't know, probably it was like ghost scent. Oh yeah, so last, I think the first time I the, there was lockdown, so that's when I discovered CeraVe and that was the worst time of my psoriasis. I had like flare-ups here, I had flare-ups on my back, I had flare-ups on my hands, I had flare-ups, I don't know, it, it, has, it connects to depression, I don't know, it messes up your mind and hygiene. So I had like minor, minor COD, COD, yeah? Yeah, <laughs> I, I had every everywhere had to be clean. Everything was just disgusting. Everything had and my trypophobia blew up. Everything was just disgusting. I hated my skin. I wanted to peel it off. It was always itching and ugh, it was the worst. It was it was terrible. It was the most terrible times of my life, and I don't want to ever go back to that point. So I retailed, I got uh, CeraVe on retail price and I got the big one that is 20 euros. I don't have it right here now, but that, it played a very big part in my in my moisturizing game. And so I used CeraVe daily and for like a month, my skin just transformed. I didn't even know when the itching stopped and my irritation for environment stopped and everything just, and I just discovered that my skin was lacking hydration. And I just need to moisturize and it had to be with the right ingredients and the ceramides in CeraVe is just and the hyaluronic acid everything just I think it, that was just what my skin needed at that time and I used it and I closed my eyes and I bought in fact I bought two so <laughs> I used it very generously on my skin and it did so like a badass result and I was so happy and now I have actually just because of my experience, I have improved in my skin, um, in my skin knowledge, and also I have read books and I have done some other consultation from other people, and I have discovered another moisturizer that I am currently loving, and I'm going to be sharing with you a few of the things I'm currently loving today. Even though I have said a lot of things in the video, but anyway, I'm just trying to like share my experience so maybe a lot of people can relate to what I'm saying. When it's hard to like find what your skin really needs, you know, and very frustrating. This is the first product that I am loving. It's I don't know how to get this in focus, but this is Amlactin. I think I posted one i think i posted this product on my ig page i did not give like a whole description of what of how amazing this product is but this is what i am currently loving and this is my fifth bottle of this although it's a bit pricey and on i recommend i recommend at i recommend on instagram retails this for like 17 or 18 there about i don't know this is what i'm currently loving and it has 12% lactic acid and here it says it's fragrance free it contains powerful 12% lactic acid that is clinically proven to boost the skin natural renewal process through gentle exfoliation so now this is a moisturizer but it's, it's an exfoliator it's an exfoliant so basically what it means is that it moisturizes your skin but then it removes dead skin from your skin so you're actually getting you're actually moisturizing but you're also exfoliating the dead skin like the top layer the dead dead cells from your skin like amazing basically i read some reviews from this product and i watched some youtube videos and the girl was like oh no it doesn't i don't like it it's not good i use it on my face blah, blah, blah. it wasn't like i understand some people have like different reactions to product but this is amazing for my psoriasis because I had like scratch wounds and wound open wounds and so many sores on my body when I used it, it stung a lot. 
but over time now my skin is so smooth I, I don't use like natural scrub exfoliant on my skin I probably use them like once a month but I don't like use it like three times a week I usually tell my clients you know I use this every day for my skin and it works like magic for my psoriasis if you know how how itchy my skin oh my god <laughs> Anyway, if I if I'm almost like now this is like this here, I'm going to get another one ASAP because if it runs out, I'm always scared that oh my god I might have like that same flare up I had in the past. So I always never run out of I'm lactin. I love there's a review on I recommend if you want to know more about I'm lactin. So yeah, you can exfoliate and it's good. I swear by it. It's for all skin types. Mostly, I would recommend this for dry skin. If you have like dry skin, this is like should be your holy grail. And Amlatin has been in existence for a really long time, but I think <laughs> the rave also started again on TikTok. Now to the second thing I'm currently loving in skincare is Luminous White. Anyway, I'm currently loving uh, Luminous White, although I have been using Luminous White for the longest time I think since the renewal of the brand and yes yeah, since the renewal paper bag of the brand this is my go-to product i'm light skin so i need something to maintain my skin tone regardless of the fact that i'm light skin i still need something to enlighten me and make my skin more rich so this is it and it's mild but it's very effective and is Absor it absorbs to the skin very naturally. It has glycerin and other 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 products But this is only recommended for already light skin Light skin people. I love I love this one. It's for the face and the body and this is 500 ml and Yeah, so if you want to have an explosive beautiful skin as a light person uh, you don't want to keep jumping, 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 jumping. This is this is this is just your stop. Actually. Basically, I never run out of luminous white, never. And although it is a bit pricey, it's a bit pricey. It actually retails for seventy five, but it's very effective. You can actually fight back for your money if it's worth it. <laughs> but remember, it's for only light skin clients. So other skin tone. Um, other skin tone clients have their own recommendation and please always stick to the recommendation given to you don't just jump but if you want to buy actually it will retail and sell to you but the truth is don't just jump just dwell in the product for like six months to get like ultimate results so well, this is my currently loving skincare products yes i'm going to be very honest in this video um i have breakouts but i zero do not care all the time that i have breakouts I don't know if that makes any sense to anybody but I always break out on my face because I'm always trying products I'm a beauty consultant but I always recommend sorry I always review products so I always try out products on my face and I always break out but it doesn't bother me because I will always heal myself because I know my skin so I know what works for me and I know what I need to make my skin work you get so a lot of people do not know the direction to go to and that's why I'm here you can just consult although there's terms and condition but then you I don't know it works better than just selecting one two three and just use you get you won't be satisfied when you get like consultation from a beauty consultant if you have problems your consultation extends to like five months so you come back and ask questions and go on on and on so yeah, I break out. I want to come close. I break out. I break out a lot, but I really don't care because I know how to work my skin. And when I just calm down and buy what I need to buy and do what I need to do, and it just goes off. Um, yeah. So I don't really get work worked up when my skin is not acting right. Anyway, currently, current. I'm not saying this thing correctly. Currently. Anyway, currently I am loving this from. Desium. and this is a brightening serum with stabilized vitamin C derivative okay I'm going to give you a back story about this when I started using this product I actually had like serious breakout here and I was really red and blah 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 because of my cycle 
so i started using this and i was using it twice a day twice a day twice a day twice a day but it looked like it was getting worse but then i was still within my cycle so i didn't know actually if it was actually working or not so after that then i noticed that the redness started to depreciate like reduce anyway i was beginning to like the effect of the serum and i'm really enjoying it because i had i used to have like yellow patches i don't know what it was but i knew that i had yellow patches but now this is this is my face now no makeup i don't have any makeup on i hardly wear makeup anyway so it's good but it, it retails really expensive it's like 11 but it, it's good almost through the bottle if you can see i'm almost through the bottle and i'm going to get another one for sure because i enjoy i am enjoying the results to be honest it was really slow at first but then i am a big fan of patient with skincare i'm more important about if it doesn't work two weeks yeah i leave it down if it doesn't work three weeks yeah i leave it down if it doesn't work one month now nah, it has to work if i leave it i have to empty the bottle so yeah this is nice and i think there's a review on this one i recommend i'm also loving this dove this is dove um sensitive deodorant stick um i'm going to say that i'm not a big fan of um antiperspirants because it always traumatizes my pits and it makes it really dark so oh for like two years i have been using alum if you know alum i don't know but alum is 100 percent the best antiperspirant i've ever used if it brightened my pits it cleared it it cleared it and it doesn't like i don't know if you sweat it does no smell nothing you know that i smell the ball i'm just saying it was it was in fact i still use it it's the best thing i've ever used is alum i don't bring it here at the moment but then i discovered this though because i don't know sometimes my psoriasis get crazy and it happens to me in my pits it's be so red like this so and i'm always itching and when i put that thing there oh, it stinks stinks so much so i was just like okay let me just substitute something like this in case when i have like flare-ups i just rub it instead of using that one so but alum dough soap this is my this is my body soap no joke although i use products for my beauty care the black soap but dough soap why because i have dry skin and this is like a moisturizing cream based soap there was actually a rave on tiktok about this product that it clears the spots blah blah blah, blah. well i don't know if you guys notice i don't really use the ring light i always want like the natural look i don't really like the ring light because it's so bright yeah this is nice but the weather is not favoring me at all so that's why i have the light there was a rave about it that he heals acne prone skin i don't know but it is a moisturizer so <laughs> It might and i'm going to also if you notice i flipped the camera because i noticed that uh, my camera was bent and i can't film the whole video again so i'm just going to stick with this one every other thing just irritates my skin so i just just i was just sticking to this moisturizing cream soap Anyway, I've just been sticking to this moisturizing cream soap and I don't know if any other person uses it, but it's actually very good. It actually has nothing inside. It just has like glycerin, lauric, lauric acid. It was actually very good. Although it has it comes in different fragrances. Every of the skin ingredient listing is all the same. If you if you're getting argan oil, blah blah blah, it all has the same ingredient listing. So I'm also going to for my face care, like I said. This is my Beauty Care Face Cream So Loud. Mm, it is really loud, so loud. And also for light skin. I'm already light skin, so basically I use everything that, that, um, product is that connects to light skinness. So I always like to take care of my skin. I don't like to have patches on my skin and the rest of that. So I'm already light skin, so using something to just um, brush up my skin is not a bad thing and every other person incorporate that too to your routine so yeah this is face care so loud if you're dark skin you can actually use this to 
brighten your skin a bit and if you're dark skin and you just have like little patches you can actually use this but it's also recommended for just light skin so if you're light skin you see more of the effects <coughs> excuse me and when you're dark skin or skin, person of color skin color i'll say person of color but it's not just light skin <laughs> anyway yeah so this is my face care and this is my it's a holy grail actually and it retails for 13 it's cheap so and it's like a 150 ml cup it's 100 percent good it helps treatment it helps with treatment and brightness so it's like a two-in-one skincare product we, we also have like um the um, smaller one like the only treatment one so it doesn't guarantee that you actually lighten using it it's just going to maintain your natural skin tone so that's what the treatment one is and it's going to help you correct the issues of your skin but basically you just have to be patient one try or one bottle might not give you a hundred percent of what you're bargaining for so if you have a like skin problems or acne prone skin that you actually just want to curtail or <clears throat> correct some things that are within the skin i think that one should be your starting point but if you are light skin uh dark skin i want to uh, be a bit brighter when i say bright i'm not saying bleach excuse me don't i don't get that you better shut up shut up if you know anything about skincare just shut up basically just shut up but in fact you can't even afford it so shut up so yeah that being said if you want to tone, okay, yeah, the Yankees use the word tone. If you want to tone your skin, probably use this one. It's good. So, yeah. And you know, you'll be like, oh my god, you see, you're already light skin. So, blah, blah, blah. yes, I'm already light skin, but then there's a process to this thing. So, my skin is not just all dapper because of I'm light skin. I don't just drink water. I use skincare products. And a lot of them. A lot of skincare products. But it is sunscreen. What is this video without sunscreen? Is this video without sunscreen? I don't think anything is more. Everything here is important, but your like the sun. Uh, yeah, let me head down. The sunscreen is hundred percent. Excuse me, very important. And over time, I have used Purito, which was like cancelled, one hundred percent cancelled because it was 50 spf it said but now then the investigators of sunscreen said it's 19 and so they had to like stop production and refund people i don't even get refunds because i got my from a retailer so i've used purito i've used uh pure puree puree is 100 good it's just that it has alcohol in it but it's good. I enjoyed the process of it. I have I bought this small English. Conceived in the UK by consultant, dermatologist, Dr. Andrew Ernie. So yeah, this is it just uses a uh, physical and chemical filters to or to have to achieve like maximum protection. So yeah, it has this UV UVA and UVB protection, fragrance free, non-sticky. 100% enjoy this. It has no fragrance, no alcohol. It it sinks, it slips into my skin. And that concludes this week's video, and I hope you enjoyed every bit of my little my little things that I'm currently loving skincare edition. So if you want to see more about me talking and raving about skincare, please give me a comment under this video like leave a comment under this video so i can know what i need to talk about and if you have other skincare problems you can leave a link or comment under this video you can also send me a dm on my instagram free consultation as you can see my light has died so i need to leave asap and i hope you enjoyed this video and give it a thumbs up and i'll see you in my next video